thank you all very much for, especially the Lions Club, for giving me just a few moments today to do a special, very special announcement. Um, uh, today I'm here as president of the Sunbury Exchange Club, along with many Exchange Club members, to honor Lee Buskey, who was a member of our club, who passed away approximately two years ago. We want to honor him because of all that he's done for us. Um, his, what he's done has been uh, quiet but impactful contributions to Sun Prairie and Dane County in the state of Wisconsin. And Lee gave selflessly so much of his time, resources, and efforts, and he never sought any credit from any member of Exchange Club or anyone in the community. Um, as I spoke with Lee's sister, who joins me here today, it struck me deeply when she mentioned that Lee was never happier than when he was volunteering for the Exchange Club. It's amazing to imagine the beauty and strength that comes when a person who lost his father at age five and suffered savagely from child abuse as a child courageously made the choice to give back to society instead of lashing out at it. If he accomplished nothing else, that would be award worthy. But Lee wanted to give back and he never ever wanted anything in return. As we give him the award today, if we had done this, while he was living, he wouldn't have even shown up today. That's how much he never wanted credit for anything. So I'm sure he's up in heaven right now, cursing every word that I'm saying as I'm up here. <laughs> uh, Lee joined the Exchange Club of Sunbury in 1988, and while he worked tirelessly in all aspects of exchange, such as corn tote sales, mum sales, ace awards, Arbor Day tree planting, the broad stand, and the give of the child a flight to wave parade, his heart was truly moved by our national project, which is the prevention of child abuse. Lee worked one-on-one uh, -on -one with RISE, which was the, also called the Family Center years ago, to provide for abused children and often arranged fundraisers such as the diaper drive for the organization. If you don't know much about the Exchange Club of Sun Prairie, it is important that you know that members serve in four areas in the community, Americanism, serving veterans, new programs, community service, and child abuse prevention. Lee's passion for helping all children, but especially those that were abused like him, was a perfect fit for our club. I know that I can speak for all our members, that we have missed him dearly and will continue for a long time to come to miss him. We are incredibly thankful for the money he has given to the Exchange Club in his passing, and we promise here today in front of all of you that we will use those funds to carry on the programs that he was so passionate about. We encourage you to visit us out at the um, corn tote sales during Corn Fest. There you will see this plaque in honor of Lee Buskey and all he's done for us on our corn tote booth, as well as this plaque, which we hang throughout the community, that shows the winning the Book of Golden Deeds Award. The Book of Golden Deeds Award is the highest award you can win in the Summer Exchange Club for volunteerism and giving back to your community. And as you can see, if you look at the members on here, I'll leave this up here for a little while. If you see the people who he follows, um, there's a long list of people on Sun Prairie who have made an impactful difference. I want to thank Chris Eckert, who joins me to you today, who is Lee's sister, for telling me about Lee's life and her life. As I mentioned, they were both abused as children, and they both give back to the community to help abuse children, and I think that deserves a huge round of applause. If you would like to learn more about the Exchange Club and what we do, uh, come find me over by the beer uh, tents and I'll be happy to tell you about it. <laughs> uh, thank you.